saw on the bottom and the side quickly helps us get a good fit. Once you have a good fit, the block almost sits up there by itself, at least on this row. And the higher up we go, the harder it is for the blocks to set them in place. And then we uh, mud the block. And at this level, we have to start putting the counterweights on to counterweight the pull. The blocks want to fall inward. Something else we also do is we put in a very long, it's about three and a half inch long screw at an angle to go between this block and join up with the next one. In the Dongia videos, they put a piece of tin or something and they, they pound it in there, but I'm afraid that, that, that uh, it would just break these, break these apart. When you put a screw in there, it, it attaches the two pretty good. And uh, then later on, as tomorrow, as the blocks get hard, we can go and uh, either unscrew or pull that, that screw out, as well as this screw right here. But we're getting up pretty high now, so it's getting a little bit more of a challenge, and we have to go a little bit slower as we put our blocks up. And here's some that we made the other day, and we're putting them in place. So I've sanded and rough sanded and rough sanded uh, the, the edge of the dome. I filled in some of the aircrete blocks that were uh, got some big holes in them. And uh, the first step after that is to go ahead and kind of uh, aircrete the wall with some foamed concrete so you can uh, do a little more sanding uh, to get it just a little bit smoother in preparation for the uh, the uh, fabric screening that's that's going on here for structural strength so I'm getting ready to do this wall here uh, next today with the uh, fabric screening that we have here in Ireland I'm using for the for this purpose for strengthening this wall I've got one more section to go here uh, this wall over here is completed and uh, all the way around and it makes it a pretty solid uh, individual piece when you put the fabric on there as we go around. All right, we have our uh, foam generator and our, our little um, air tank there. Uh, this thing still works pretty good. Turn it on and we get lots and lots of foam and it's just like, uh, just like a shaving cream that comes out of that as we're mixing it. So that continues to work well. Uh, one of these setups of aircrete blocks, and we did this yesterday. So we'll make blocks out of this. Uh, this will get us uh, roughly uh, uh, 32 blocks to use up on the dome. 
So that's what we're doing one of these every day.